Okay, guys, so as you may know, I do run a soccer podcast with my son where we've actually uh, done some really cool things with analytics, and he plays at a high level in soccer himself. And this is one thing that I think has really changed, and um, I even noticed my uh, the academy that we went to in uh, Nova Scotia was using tools like this in order to record the games. And basically, I mean, it, it's, it's once you realize what it can do, it's like a whole new ball game with what you're able to, uh, to record, right? So I'm just gonna show you this as an example in terms of soccer. So I'll play this right here as it's, uh, as it's going and you'll see it, it does the AI ball tracking. This just takes a while because it's, it's kind of showing as it is right here. Now, typically you're not gonna have the, uh, the recording from this height, okay? It comes with a tripod, a seven foot tripod that you have to put right on the center line. Um, and as you can see, this is right on the center line. You see the AI ball tracking. So it actually like flows and moves um, with the play. So you don't, you can actually like, as the person recording, you don't need to be like moving back and forth anymore. Um, that can all be tracked automatically. This is more the view that you're gonna get with the, um, uh, from the, the seven foot uh, area. Um, so it's not as dramatic as that other one, but what it can do is it can it auto tracks all the things so you can skip ahead to different shots, different blocks, um, you know, different goals and, and that sort of thing. So that, that comes with the, uh, with the tool as well. And then there are video analysis where it can look at where people are in terms of their position and it will, you know, try to, try to, you know, predict or, or uh, play back um, or, you know, correctly tag these events that happen in the actual motion. So this is a great example of how AI has blown things out of the water in terms of recording for kids sports. Um, so I really, really like this and what it can do. Um, perfect club for a perfect camera actually for any club. And you basically just, um, you know, we'll bring this, it will take four hours to process the, the, the video cause it goes through the AI and that sort of stuff. And then you can actually have the pro analytics, right? So, um, you don't need to have that, but um, just the actual video is gonna be so much smoother, so much higher quality than what you can get with an iPhone because it's actually made you know, to do just that. And with the way that the recording has, has uh, come, it's, it's, really, um, it's really made it, uh, made it powerful to, uh, to do. So this is soccer. You can also, of course, use this for basketball, for hockey, for volleyball, any of these sports. Um, and it's been used at, you know, they're using it La Masia in, uh, in, in uh, Barcelona uh, and a ton of different places because it gets really good recordings that you can actually like play back and have actionable advice with. And, and that's really what coaches want. So if you have a high level player that's playing in one of these, um, uh, you know, sports, this can really be a powerful thing to uh to look into and it's great for all these different um all these different sports so you can use the pixel on air uh which is ideal or you can actually bring your own uh, the pixel on air does a really really good job anyhow i'll put a link in the description uh, this is kind of probably one of those things where um you know it is a bigger purchase and you might want to have a little bit more hands-on about how it works. So I would suggest scheduling a demo so you can kind of see how it works and, um, you know, maybe test it out for yourself and, and see, you know, how it works with your individual sport and how people have done, um, done that before and what kind of feedback that you can get from that. As always, if you do have questions, hit me up in the comments. And if you have used this or a similar tool, um, let me know in the comments what tool you used and how effective it was and what you thought about it. And I think that would be uh, awesome to share with, uh, with our audience. All right, that's it for this video. We'll see you in the next one.